vagina. Hello everybody, Z3KO Trinity here. I'm back with another video. I know, what happened to making a video every single day in October? Well, I do apologize guys. Life gets in the way. I woke up this morning with a really sore throat, so that's lovely. Um, but yeah, I've been pretty busy trying to hang out with friends, trying to get this room set up, trying to, um, do all kinds of things. The most recent badass thing I did was go to a Metallica concert. Metallica is my favorite band of all times. And it was just completely amazing. Uh, the set list wasn't exactly what I was hoping for, but I still had such a great time. I did film it. I don't know whether I'll upload it or not, but we'll see. Um, anyway, I just had a badass time at the concert. And, um,. I was going to do a horror vlog this past Wednesday, but my idea for the horror vlog was based on a uh, Scream movie. So it's going to be a Scream edition of the horror vlog, and it was going to be uh, starring my brother, because he is like the god of gods when it comes to the Scream movies. He knows every single thing about them. And for me, I would have to look up details and look up all this stuff. And, well, I'm lazy. But, yeah, so be looking forward to that. I'm also going to be doing an actual review on the Creeped Out show. And recently, I've been watching, uh, binge watching, me and Alexis have been binge watching House on Haunted Hill, which is fantastic so far. Spoiler for the review. But uh, anyway, we're not done with it yet. We got like, what, three episodes left or something? Mm -hmm. Four episodes? <laughs> all right. But uh, yeah, she's totally not in the room at all. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, but anyway, today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys this. My penis. No, I'm just kidding. Um, it's the Horror Hall uh, mystery box. It comes, at least it says, what it comes with is a... Friday the 13th plushie uh, of the mask, the shining keychain, a uh, Freddy Krueger scarf, and a mug that has the exorcist on it. So I'll get a close up if you can see. And then it's supposed to come with a mystery vinyl figure. I did buy two of these, but one's a Christmas gift, so shh, you guys be quiet, okay? Let's scissor this thing open, shall we? I mean, people went to a bar and said, hey, let's scissor. All right. The back is just the solid gray, same as the side. It doesn't show any other pictures. Um, I found this at Walmart, so if you guys go to your nearest Walmart, they might have this. But it's uh, pretty cool. Let's see where this opens up from. I think. It's supposed to open up somewhere here. I can see the crease right here. Well, right here. We'll do it from the side here. You guys know me versus boxes. I get a little rough with them. Get a little rough. Alright, we're going to pull out... We're going to pull out. Oh, check it out. The Exorcist mug. Check that out. Check it out. It glows in the dark. Whoo! That is so badass. There's what the mug actually looks like. So that's cool. Showing Alexis. Glows in the dark. We're going to open this bad boy up. And styrofoam. Let's rip off all it came with the styrofoam. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, here we are. Oh shit, my keychain almost <laughs> fell out. Uh, that's pretty nice. I like that. It's like your typical standard mug uh, with the Exorcist front cover of it. Looks really nice, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. Mm, it looks really good. I like that. Uh, before it almost falls off, Oh, that is even better than what I thought it was. It's the room number 237 keychain from The Shining, the Fushizzle. 
Uh, that is so cool. You can put that on your keys, which I probably will. Uh, let's see, what else do we got in this bag of goodies? We got some salt that we can eat. Hell yeah. Sprinkle that over my mayonnaise. Um, we got our little plushy pillow of the Friday the 13th head. <laughs> that's kind of cute. It's really, really small. So that's a uh, travel size there. I can let my cat lay on that as head on it as a pillow. Thank Mr. Winkers will. Alright, we also have Freddy Krueger's nice scarf. This Christmas scarf, just in time for Christmas. So that's cool. We also pulled out this. Uh, we appreciate your feedback. Thank you for purchasing a Culture Fly product. Please take a moment to complete this online survey and I will receive a 50% off your first order on culturefly.com. Well, sweetness. First order on culture. Does it have a cute, uh, like a code word on it? Because I really don't plan on it. Oh, you just got to fill the survey. So, yeah, if you guys want to fill out the survey, you could get a 50% off uh, for that uh, nice stuff they have. And now the moment that we've all been waiting for, the mysterious box. First thing I see is it written on the side. That's all that was in the box. Ooh, just plain old Pennywise standing in all his gloriness. Get a little close up of that guy. That's a good one. It's a really nice one too. Uh, love the side of the box with him and Georgie there. Um, I wonder if they were all Stephen King it related, like because the mystery like showed Pennywise, or if this is like the actual one. I'm gonna have to like look up actual videos before I drop him, but we're going to open this bad boy up. He pops right out with ease. Just a nice little Pennywise stand, little circular stand, and he's not really doing nothing special. The bottom of the stand just fell off, so that's nice. I'm going to have to get glue for that, but uh, yeah, that's uh, pretty much it, guys. It? Get it? Ha! 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 Oh, sorry. Um, but anyway, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate every last one of you. And until next time, I guess. Uh, instead of leaning back, that'd be so great.